Good morning, everyone. It is currently 6.15 in the morning, and I'm about to go do 45 minutes of cardio. I didn't sleep well last night. I'm really hungry, but we gotta get it done. I didn't want to show you guys my little outfit. I love these shorts. These are the Gymshark shorts. I can't remember what they're called, but they have this little, like, sticky thingy that just kind of stays in place. And this is just from Amazon. I'm gonna talk to you guys when I get back from cardio. Okay, so I did go do cardio. Now I showered. I had to leave really fast because I am meeting one of my old friends for coffee. Her name is Madison, so she actually competed in the same one that I competed my first time around. Um, so this was like th four years ago. And we did like our whole prep together. Like we did cardio together, we did posing together. So it was just like really nice to have someone there. And I haven't seen her in probably like two years. We're just gonna get some coffee and catch up. I'll probably get a tea to be honest. No, I haven't eaten, but we're gonna eat when we get home. I'll talk to you guys after. Got a little tea with Madison. <laughs> we're just gonna chat for a little bit and I'll catch you guys when I actually eat breakfast in like probably two hours. Okay, so I just got done catching up with Madison. We sat outside, so my face is kind of red. Did end up getting just a turmeric ginger tea. I didn't want coffee just because I don't know if people are like this, but like if I have coffee, I need to be like eating my breakfast with it. I'm weird like that. I like to enjoy it like with my oatmeal or my waffles or whatever I'm eating for breakfast. We are three a little we're under three weeks out so i just had my check-in on saturday for three weeks out macros have lowered a little bit i will put my updated calories here because i don't know them from the top of my head training just changed today or yesterday actually which is a little bit more circuit based which is new for me yeah it absolutely kicked my butt i was drenched i'm very tired i don't really have a lot of energy now me just being able to get out of my bed and like walk outside i'm just like man that's a lot of work yeah i'm about to go make breakfast so i will go show you guys that really quick i'm probably going to make zucchini oats i know that sounds weird i know that sounds really gross but i promise they're good zucchini you can kind of like mix in the flavor like they're they're kind of flavorless to be honest unless you like season it or do whatever you want with it that's why a lot of people make like zucchini brownies zucchini pancakes and stuff i put it in my oatmeal for more volume let's go make some zucchini oats for the base you're gonna need 30 grams of oatmeal six grams of chia seeds then about 70 grams of zucchini or you can just do half of a large one add some water till you fill it right above the zucchini then you're gonna add it to the burner and just mix it around until it looks like a very thick consistency you still want to leave a little bit of water in it so you can put in your protein powder so I did about half a scoop of protein so 15 grams and mixed it around and then served it up with my berries and peanut butter and coconut so we topped it with 55 grams of strawberries one gram of coconut flakes and 16 grams of a peanut cashew butter look how yummy that looks this is actually going to be my entire breakfast so i have the zucchini oats and i also have 75 grams of egg whites with one egg some mushrooms bell pepper and onion topped with some tabasco and then just some coffee with that same macadamia creamer that i always have this one's the one i've been using a lot and the cinnamon one but the cinnamon one has a little bit more calories so i'm currently just using this one 
I tend to push my meals a little bit back now just so I feel fuller throughout the day. So it is currently 11.30, so this is going to be my breakfast. Absolutely demolished. Okay guys, so I just did a thing. Devin and I have been wanting to go to Colombia to visit my family and stuff and to like just kind of vacation. Last year in May, we were supposed to go to Colombia for I think like almost two weeks, two to three weeks. We were supposed to visit family, go to Cartagena, go to Armenia, Bogota, just kind of visit my home country. He's never been out of the country. So that was our plan last year, but then the COVID hit and we had to cancel everything. And we just booked our flights to Colombia two days after my show. So I compete July 10th and July 12th, we leave straight to Cartagena. So Monday to Thursday, and then Thursday night to Monday morning, we will be in Bogota. So I'm so pumped. I literally just confirmed our last tickets. I'm so excited. Okay, now I'm really hungry, so I am gonna have a snack, or I'll probably just have lunch. It's pretty far into the afternoon. That's all I really wanted to update you guys on, so I'll see you for lunch. All right, so we just made lunch. 2.5 ounces of salmon, 170 grams of gemstone potatoes, and then about 60 grams of mushrooms with 140 grams of zucchini and some Tabasco on top. So that is going to be my lunch. I do have to do some homework and stuff because I am taking summer classes. So I'm gonna do that while I eat this. Then I gotta go run to the grocery store and that's about it for right now. So I'll see you guys probably when I get back from the grocery store. So I lied, I'm not going to the store yet. I got really hungry again, like 30 minutes after my lunch. So I am going to have a little snack. So it's just two plain rice cakes, just two plain ones. I put a tablespoon of almond butter on there with four grams of honey and then just one apple cinnamon rice cake. I'm gonna eat this, then I'm gonna head to the grocery store. All right, and we are back from the grocery store. I did a lot of groceries, it took a long time. I'm gonna go ahead and have dinner now that I'm back. This is what we have going on. We got some asparagus with some Cholula, 90 grams of tofu, I just air fried it. About 40 grams of avocado with everything but the bagel seasoning. And the asparagus, 140 grams. This is what we got going on for dinner. I love uh, cream of wheat with some protein powder and like berries. And I always log it in the morning that way. Like I know I can have it before I go to bed. And to me, that's like so satiating. So I'll talk to you guys when I make my cream of rice. This is, I'll probably show you guys better. 30 grams of cream of rice with 10 grams of protein powder, a tablespoon of peanut butter, four grams of honey, and 60 grams of strawberries. And this will be our last meal. Hello everyone. It has been some time now. I am ready to go to bed. I already drank my chamomile tea. I was trying to think of anything else to like update you guys on, but I pretty much just talked about like my macros and calories already and stuff. We did hit a new low weigh-in on Saturday, 117.4. Pretty much about it. Nothing has really changed other than that. Devin and I will be doing a Q&A in my peak week video. As far as physique and stuff like that, I am pretty happy with how I look. Obviously, and please keep this in mind, I did lose 60 pounds. My skin isn't tight. My skin is going to be a little bit looser and droopier than most competitors. So I just wanted to post a picture here of one of my first posing sessions with Megan and today's uh, check-in picture. So I'm gonna post those up here. And again, just keep in mind, I did lose 60 pounds. It's just the reality of things. Like I know I don't look shredded to a T, but yeah, it is what it is. I just wanted to share that just to, so you guys can see like a comparison of both of like when I like the beginning towards like now. Uh, so yeah, that's all I really have. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to continue, you know, watching me all the way to stage, I would greatly appreciate that. This is literally something just fun to do, like, on the side. I'm starting to really just, like, enjoy talking to the camera and enjoy just kind of taking you guys along with me. Like and subscribe if you haven't. Follow me to my road to stage. Follow me on Instagram, Manuel Herrera underscore fit. Stay tuned also for after show because I will be vlogging all the yumminess in Colombia and all the foods and all the travels and everything. That's all I got. So 
I will catch you guys for my two week out video. See ya. <laughs>